So yeah, that whoever threw that paper, and then the teacher talks to that person's mom. Like that's deep. I can't really say anything else about this because I'll just play the clip. What you say? What you say? I said whoever threw that paper, your mom's a hoe. <laughs> 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 yeah, so I don't really think that's what a teacher, a normal teacher with care for the students will do. That sounds like someone who would, wouldn't mind slapping the children if he had to. Literally. Now, the other two. Because I really cannot talk about this one that much, the first one I just mentioned, because I didn't really experience it. But I heard the other two, I, I, like, I heard it go on, but I wasn't, it didn't happen in my school. to go to the toilet as i said this stupidity of putting your hand up to go to the toilet when your jacket indoors and wearing a hat is all a sin and is not allowed because you know it's now officially a sin it's if you break these rules these three things you have now sinned against <laughs> because that's what they're trying to tell you but that's besides the point so the kid just wanted to go to the toilet but the teacher was like, no, uh, uh, mm -mm, you cannot go to the toilet. You cannot go to that toilet today, not today. So, so I'm like, okay, I can't go to the toilet, but I can also go to the toilet. So he got up out of the class. He gets stormed off, but also dipped at the exact same, same, same thing. And then went back to the toilets. And then the teacher called the head of that year and then that teacher, let's call, okay, so the teacher that was teaching the class, let's call her Miss B, okay, Miss A, and then the head of the year, let's call her Miss B, yeah. So the head of that year, Miss B, was waiting outside of the classroom door, literally. So when the student, let me call him, call him Timothy. So Timothy, that's this is really not his actual name. Timothy came back from the toilet, and then Miss Miss B, the head of year, Miss B, started shouting at this kid, and these words were what I heard. Yeah. So, from the explanation that the student was telling me of what happened, yeah, he said, "Oh, Miss B said." Did God give you permission to go toilet? Did, did I did I give you permission to go toilet? Did your parents give you permission to go toilet? Then why did you go toilet? And then and then she this Miss B started dissing Timothy's parents. Imagine dissing 
poor, poor little Timothy here just just had a small bladder and wanted to let loose, loose of his little yellow liquid called pee in something called a toilet, which is something that you could literally do. You did not need. Okay, kind of is a privilege, but if you have a thing, then it's not privilege to be able to pee. It is actually a privilege to be able to pee, but if you have a thing and there's nothing wrong with it, then it's not a privilege to be able to pee. Yeah, and then he's the Miss B started dissing his parents, parents, on how they raised Timothy, little Timothy here, is pissing his pants right there and then, screw pissing the toilet, screw pissing in the toilet, yeah, he's pissing his pants right here and right now, it's just sad, yeah. and Miss A was doing nothing, just, you know, teaching, teaching the class, like, oh yes, don't mind Timothy outside, if you look at him, I will give you a detention, that is genuinely how it was as well. Yeah, and another one, this is, again, another thing that I heard, yeah, this teacher, he was literally like, hitting every single child that was in his way, and yelling to them to F off and everything, it was, it was like a horror movie, imagine seeing a horror movie with the teacher hitting children and telling them to F off, imagine that, like, like there's some teachers, like I said before, that are good, some teachers, are really crappy and don't care about the students at all who knows some teachers might even be racist who knows and um last point don't be a bad teacher also there are a lot of things to learn from in this video how school kind of doesn't suck i hope i changed your mind slightly on how school actually doesn't suck and it's just don't blame the teachers blame your mondays you know mondays just gives off if you start a day with a monday it just gives off a wrong vibe you know the word mondays literally just makes me lazy yeah it just wants me to uh, like i just want to stay in bed yeah so start your day off with a tuesday call your first day tuesday and then it's all, it's all calm, but then you're going to have to look at the whiteboard and literally Monday is spelt out and then your eyes are going to droop and then your sad face is going to appear and then you're going to slouch on your chair and do your work all sloppily. Yeah. So, um, hope you enjoyed the video. See you next time.